welcome back to my channel we are back with another monthly munch pack unboxing for those that don't know it is $25 a month mm -hmm. $25 a month and you get like 10 snacks to try from around the world this is our third box or fourth box yeah I don't remember I don't remember um I don't know exactly what month this was we were a little delayed but it will be in the title of this video that you clicked on. But without further ado, we normally take turns picking snacks out of the box um, back and forth. We don't like to just peek and see what's inside, so we like to be surprised. So I will do the honor of going first. Yep. All right. The first thing is biscuit rock salt flavor. I feel like we've had these before. Not rock salt flavor. That sounds weird. I thought we had these in one of a munch pack we tried like maybe a long time ago. We're gonna try it today though. Looks like a little buttery cracker. Almost like a Ritz. Smells good. Oh god. Rock salt flavor. It's salted. It's like a Ritz cracker. I was expecting like salt. Alright. Oh, there's a big one right here at the front. Mmm, potato chips. Yep. Yeah. Premium potato chips. So foie gras flavored Sabora foie gras. Torres Selecta. A lot of stuff I can't say. Ooh. Flavor of these smells fine. I don't know why she's. It smells like potato chips. What a funny smell. Don't be weird. Never mind. Never mind. I'll take it back. It smells them like more than that. I mean, ooh. What I flavor? Don't, are those? I don't know what. Hang they, on. they didn't put a sticker on it. What is foie gras? Milk, potatoes, sunflower oil, foie gras flavoring. There's something weird. Whatever foie gras is. Give me your water. It's my water. You just didn't get a drink. <laughs> Sucks to not be prepared. Those are good. You can see right here it says something foie gras. I need to look up what foie gras is. It's probably in the little book at the end. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Okay. Oof. That's not good. Not a fan. Open that box. I didn't. You oh, kind of opened it too far. Look, you looked. No, I didn't. She looked. No. All right. Ooh. All right. Zoozle Spiral. It looks like a fruit roll-up sour candy thing. Oh, I feel man. like every month we this get gonna be a sour tasty. candy. Yeah, it's going to be good. Looks good. <laughs> yeah. It's absolutely delicious. As you would assume from a rope of sugar and more sugar. That was good. You want some more? Yeah, let's take the rest of this. Why oh. wasn't it right? I get late in the trip. <laughs> no. Very well. Not today. Wow. That was good. All right. Ooh. Oh. These are always good, but I've never had this flavor. Yeah, we never had this particular flavor. Hello, Panda. Caramel. But caramel flavor. Cream center with a crunchy shell. I like Hello Panda, so I know I'm gonna like these. Those are the ones have me salivating right now. I opened that all wrong. <laughs> Tear it's here. A big thing that says tear here, and I just. They come in a little package. Again. There's a package inside the package. Use those muscles. Ooh, that is a strong caramel smell. These could be bad. 
These smell like those jello things oh, we did on that no. one day. Yeah, they do. All right. Oh it's way better than the caramel things. Yeah, those are, uh, these are delicious. These are going to be gone? No. All right. Weird. Oh no, what? What? I don't know. What did you pull? Chorus Whistle Candy. I don't. Um, I, I don't know. Rue Ramoon Jumping Cola Candy. How do we do this? Okay, there's a little tear thing here. I have no idea. How it comes with like, they look like little lifesavers. But then it comes with a little box. Oh, it's just like a little toy. I, I guess. I guess, and then we just, all right. It's like a little pig toy. I guess it just comes with a little toy. A toy I, in every box? I have no idea. I, I don't know. This feels like it's got like a. I bet you these are gonna be like those little things that like taste like soda. They like fizz in your mouth. Yeah. Oh. It's soft. Is it? Oh no, I bit into it. It's soft. They're good, but I I'm confused. Whistle candy? Or are we supposed to do something with this toy? I guess we'll find out at the end. It just says jumping battle. Maybe you're supposed to put it in water? I mean, it's got like a whistle right here. Oh, Maybe because you, you can whistle through, through it? it? Try another one. Oh. So they're actually hollow. So they're, there's not just a hole through it. If you look inside it, it's actually completely hollow on the inside. That's annoying. But cool. Okay, eat it. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh man, it's like a kazoo. Mm. <laughs> okay. I didn't want to eat another one though. They're weird and soft. I like them though. I don't know. Like vanilla cracker thing? Little cookies. Looks like in a cookies in a tube. They look like they're vanilla flavor from what I can tell. Oh, it's actually in a sleeve. Oh, that's convenient. I'm they just, look like I'm little Ritz crackers. Like the cheese Ritz crackers? Yeah, they look good with a little cream filling. All right, I'm, I'm on board with these. Yeah, they're tasty. Maybe I'm weird. They have a weird aftertaste. Stop reaching for my water. I didn't pick it up for you. I don't like those. She puts it back on her side. <laughs> there hasn't been any chocolate. This feels like a Stroopenwaffle again. Oh, I hope it's a Stroop. A Stroopenwaffle. They've been giving Stroopenwaffles on the airplane. Yeah, they always give those things. Oh. It looks like a Stroopenwaffle. It is in fact a Stroopenwaffle. Double Dutch maple flavor. <laughs> Double Dutch. <laughs> That's what it says. Double Dutch maple flavor. Well, I know flavor. it does, yeah. Canada's getting in the Our game. delicious Stroop waffles are perfect as a tasty snack oh, anytime. I Stroop waffles. I need to find them at the next. I didn't think they're okay. <laughs> right. We're going to have the worst later. Alright, just your typical Stroop waffle. Oh, yeah. 
And guess you what? want the bigger half? Yeah, I did. It's gonna be maple flavored. Mm-hmm. Not as good as the chocolate ones and stuff like that, but. Like, stripper waffles are good, but I wouldn't go out of my way for them. I would. Alright. No. I would, in fact, drive a couple miles for this stripper waffle. Oh, these look interesting. You have to introduce it. Okay. Got a mouthful of Stroop and Waffle. Sippy candy in straw green apple flavor. But they're little. It look like it reminds me of the idea of like a pixie stick. But I, I don't know. Look good. I guess let's do the thing. Oh, there's a tear on the side. Like how do I eat this? So it's like a... Actually, is it a straw? How do I get it out of the straw? Probably to suck it out. It's a sippy. You gotta use your teeth. Yeah. This is weird. This is weird. I don't... I don't know. <laughs> it's a weird texture. It's like... It's weirdly soft. It's like a cream. A green apple cream. I wouldn't buy it. It's way too much work. It almost, is a lot almost of Almost no gain. Yeah, not a... It's an interesting one. Not a big We fan. haven't tried one like that. It didn't taste bad, though. So, I mean, there's that. It did taste good. It's just, maybe maybe for a kid, left? maybe for like a small kid. No, actually a small kid would be bad. They just eat the whole thing and choke on a straw. Ooh, another Cheeto something. Oh, nice. Those are just corn Cheetos. They, I don't even know what kind. They didn't put stickers on them this time. I think they're corn Cheetos because I saw a picture of corn. Yeah, I, yeah, I saw, is it popcorn maybe? I no, they look know. like. Open it. They look like Cheerios. They're O's, and X's, and O's. Oh yeah. All right. X's and O's. Smells like a Cheeto puff. It smells pretty good. Oh. I got a weird flavor. Close to an onion ring. Like the. No, Funyun, sorry. Close to Funyuns. But not as good as a Funyun. Mm -mm. Not bad because I'm starving though. It's a Funyun without the fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so last it's one's you. Neat. Neat. Yep. This looks like it's going to be crummy. Cat, 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 tat. Sorry. Didn't we have something? Cat Cat Tat. Not to be confused with Cat Cat Cat. Didn't we have something like Made this? Made by Ooker, because it has an umlauts on it. So you know it's really cool. Oh, it's a pastry with hazelnut flavored puff pastry. Oh, is that what it, where are you reading that? Oh, <laughs> puff pastry with hazelnut flavored cocoa cream. Ooh, cocoa cream. Careful, this looks like it's gonna be crummy. Oh, oh. open that box. I'm not getting crumbs everywhere. Yeah, good call on that. There, there's a lot of crumbs. If you could just see the they, amount they, of they crumbs. Can't, they can't see the crumbs. It just fell. Look, see, it's just crumbling. Anyways, though. The puff pastry is good. Is it? <laughs> no. Tastes all right. It's stuck in my teeth. How do you get stuck in your teeth? Look. It's weird. 
<laughs> Alright. Alright. Bring out bring out the little booklet. Hmm. Apparently they sell cereal now. <laughs> like their own brands of cereal. Well, it's random brands of cereal from around the world. Hmm. So it's like munch pack, but with cereals. Cereal. All right. Oh no, we gotta speed it up. Our camera's gonna die. Oh no. Huh. Cheetos Pizza Tic Tac Toes. They are from Israel. Uh, and they were they were. I think it tasted fine. Uh, let's see. From Poland is where we had that. Uh, yeah, the delicious sweet and sour candy spiral. Uh, we had the vanilla and salt. Wait. Do we have that? Oh yeah, bourbon petite vanilla and salt cookie. Didn't like those. Which was this. I thought they tasted fine. She's weird. Those are from Japan. We had the Uker Kit Kat Tat with cocoa filling. That's from Turkey. Wasn't bad. Not a bad flavor. A bit flaky, in my opinion. Uh, oh, the Cho Fu Biscuits Rock Salt Flavor from Taiwan. I like these. They're pretty good. We had the Chorus Whistle Candy, which was strange. That's from... <laughs> That checks. Japan. Because they make strange candies and oh, those I chips. flipping love that country. That's why duck liver? Alright, Taurus foie gras. So if you're feeling adventurous, it's from Spain. These finger licking good chips mm -mm, no, are infused with foie gras. Yeah, duck liver. They're not good. Foie gras is not good. Duck livers, not good. At least their version. All right, we had the double Dutch maple stroop waffle. Oh man, I called it. Canada. Of course, Canada <laughs> makes it maple. I saw the maple leaf and I was like, oh, the Canadians are at it again. But they went with a stroop waffle and that's flipping delicious. Hello, Panda Caramel. Didn't see that coming. United States. Didn't know that. I didn't see it, nope. Uh, then they had the Sippy Green Apple. <laughs> Makes sense. A Sippy Straw You Can Eat. China. Well, you messed up, China. China. everything, right? I didn't like it, and you made a terrible candy. Okay. That was everything. And, yeah, the rest is the family pack and stuff like that. All right. What was your favorite thing? Uh... Probably this, I mean... Probably those foie gras duck liver chips. Mm. Not. No, I think I think the uh, the candy... The... Yeah. Yeah, I mean... I mean, these are always... I like these rock salt biscuits. You give me sweet biscuits. and sour? Mm, I'm there. These are good. Yeah, they're good. Alright. Well, that wraps up this month's munch pack. Let us know what you thought in the comments down below. Give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you like our content, there's more coming next month. But we are gonna wrap this up because my camera is about to die and... You know, it's been blinking for a while. Yeah, it hasn't cut us off yet. But we love and appreciate you all for supporting our small channel and we hope to see you, well, I'll see you in next week's video. He'll be back in a month. <laughs> I'll be sleeping somewhere. <laughs> Bye guys.